now the the next thing that as you said that you have interned this last summer uh, at microsoft so how was your experience at microsoft how was your interview experience how you applied for it how was the uh, particular thing Right yeah so uh, the first thing is the interview process i would tell so like uh, microsoft visited uh, our campus so it was an on campus offer so uh, like uh, ms visits our campus every year for interns so last year also they visited uh, our campus for interns and like uh, we had four rounds like the first round was an online assessment so we had two questions and 90 minutes so uh, those are basic cp questions uh, like uh, normal code forces type questions and you were given 90 minutes so the first question as far as i remember was a uh, mathematical question and the second was a dp question so i solved both of the questions and uh, solved them within like uh, 60 minutes i guess and uh, then the there were three rounds the first two rounds were purely dsa and the last round was uh, the hr plus dsa like uh, the last round was not exactly dsa it was some kind of an open ended dsa question and an hr round so if i talk about the dsa uh, round so basically uh, they came up with a question and you have to give a solution as simple as that also like you have to talk about the approach talk about how you arrived at the approach this is very important like how you are arriving at the approach like what are the observations you are making to reach the answer uh, like you should talk while coding and you should talk while thinking like what you are thinking and why you, you are thinking okay so apart from this like you have to code the right solution and then you have to dry run a sample test case so they will give you a sample test case and you have to dry run that sample test case on the code you have written and at the end you have to uh, tell the time and the space complexity of your uh, approach okay so this is a basic overview of the DSF problem and most of the DSF problems or the DSA rounds goes like this only like in any uh, companies I like be it uh, Microsoft create media.net Google coordination anything like every DSA rounds goes more or less similar to this okay so like the first two rounds were DSA and the last round was a nature and a DSA round so in that uh, round, like I was given a uh, hypothetical situation or a hypothetical question, like uh, let's say this happens. So how would you solve this problem using the data structures and algorithms you know? So like uh, there is no perfect answer to this question. Okay, so you means uh, they are looking, they're telling you to optimize as much as you can. Okay, so basically as far as I remember, so they told me to design some kind of a game uh, with a uh, minimum uh, complexity minimum time complexity so basically you have to optimize as much as possible and make the user experience better okay and for the hr round uh, uh, they asked me about the projects that i have done the projects that were there in the resume and some hypothetical situations like which may occur while i am working uh, at microsoft and how would you face those situations okay so for example like uh, if I say like this happens, how would you react to this situation and how would you handle this situation? So questions like this. So there are three rounds and one OA round. So this was basically the interview process. And if I talk about my experience or the internship experience, it was a great experience, I would say. So I was working in, an, in the supply chain org of Microsoft. So basically uh, in uh, I, used uh, object oriented programming in my internship so i had to uh, design an api wrapper so it was a great experience so for the it was also the first time i was interning at an mnc so i learned a lot about how to write code how to uh, get code reviews how to not write code so many things like that how to name or how to comment code or how to uh, means uh, reach or approach people or and how to learn things from other people so it was a great experience also like it was a great experience to interact with senior software engineers and like yeah engineering managers they do have a lot of knowledge in uh, the software engineering domain so i would say that anyone who will be interning in the next summer just go and reach out people like you will learn a lot okay so you will really learn a lot so don't hold back like if you have some questions or anything just go and tell to your mentor or to any senior SW or you can even reach out to your manager. Managers more often are really helpful. Okay. So 
it was a great uh, experience and like at the end of the internship i had uh, two ppo interviews uh, like one ppo interview was another dsa round just similar to the internship interview and another was a system design round so system design round was a basic uh, was a formal system design so uh, don't ignore system design that's another tip like uh, it's it's really very useful for ft interviews as well so i had two interviews so the interviews went well so basically for the ppo uh, result so your manager's feedback and the interview feedbacks combined gives you the ppo result so like my interviews went well and my manager was also satisfied with my work so i secured a ppo so basically that was uh, my experience at microsoft till now